everybody is a star. Oh, baby, suddenly, everybody wants to shine. But who come out on a cloudy day? Tis the sun that loves you bound. When the system tries to bring you down. Everybody is a star. One big circle going round and round. Good morning. Hey, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. This is a sports edition. I want to say something about Caitlin Clark. And um, I know a lot of y'all might be a little pissed. And, and I want you to get over it, okay? Because while I, I see a lot of jealousy going on with uh, Caitlin, I mean, it's no different than when LeBron hit the league. And Carlos Boozer and Darius Miles and all those guys that played for Cleveland, they was like, no dude out of high school going to sit running for us. It was the same phenomenon. My problem is y'all making it a big deal because she's white. And that, for that, you messing up the sport. Caitlin is a once-in-a-lifetime talent. She's a Larry Bird. And Steph Curry, she's cut from that cloth, and she's just um, entertaining to watch. Now, with that being said, that don't have nothing to do with uh, Angel Reese, Aaliyah Boston. Um, it's got nothing to do with any of them. And for Caitlyn, you need to toughen up a little bit. And it is ball. That's how rookies get treated. I'm from this generation where rookies got they was even, they was hazed. I think the only rookie that didn't that stopped that was Kenyon Martin. Okay, because he was like, okay, try me. But most of the rookies went along with it. I mean, almost like you made them walk to Brooklyn for cheesecake. If you know what I mean. So I don't want to hear all this, you know, cheap shot and you know some people should be fined after the fact. Um, listen, let's don't let's don't muddy this up. Even though I know races and everything, so who are we to try to take it out? They done messed this damn world up with race and color, and now y'all don't want to even uh, uh, take it serious when it does happen. And um, it can cause you to not like white people. But you have to think beyond that and you have to know the origin of that whiteness and how it was created. Because once you break all that stuff down, then you just realize that uh, there's just white people, white people. In. They done made up some shit like the master narcissist and then got the whole world singing the song back, which is a song of race. So... Stay out of that. If you can stay above that, you know, you might can't stay out of it. If you can just try to stay above it a little bit, you could see um, your way clear. Because, I mean, come on. Y'all know they, the girl who, who, uh, Dewana Bonner is white. She throw <laughs> Angel Reese down on the ground across her neck and her head bopped on the ground. Y'all ain't said nothing about that. Nobody making a big deal out of that. So listen, Caitlin Clark going to get roughed up a little bit. That's the name of the game. 
And it's like Diana Taurasi said, and I don't think that she was trying to be funny. She said, well, y'all, you get ready to play. I mean, it ain't, it's levels to this shit. And it's levels to everything. This ain't going to be no cakewalk. You're going to be in here playing with some grown-ass women who know how to hoop to hoop. And you stuck with that. So you're going to have to get stronger. I mean, you were co- you was a college phenomenon. Now you want to go to the next level. Level, excuse me. You got to toughen up. You got to get stronger, and you got to go after them. And uh, don't take it. If they bow you, give them one back. It's just that simple. I I didn't hear um, Angel Reese complaining when y'all knocked when they she got knocked down on the ground across the neck. She said, "Hey, I like it. You ain't gonna treat me different because I'm a rookie." And I think that Angel, um, that uh, Caitlin Clark should have the same mindset. Otherwise, people are going to resent you because here you are, a white girl. You already good. And then, I mean, you already are outstanding. <laughs> you beyond good, girl. But you allowing them to uh, use... They're sick minds because they really don't care about you. They just like to stir up the race uh, card shit, okay? And they really like to, um, you know, big up whiteness and then gaslight everybody else. So don't fall into it. Keep playing the way you play. Just get tougher and understand that you playing with grown-ass women now. You ain't playing with the little college girls, Okay. And that's important for everybody that like to watch the WNBA. Um, so for all of y'all saying that the rest of the girls is jealous and all that kind of stuff, y'all need to freeze that. You really do. And uh, to my uh, W ballers, just go ahead and, and hoop. That's it. And that's all I got to say on the matter, okay, regarding Caitlin Clark being abused. So, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share, and I will see you in the next video.